YouTube. Today I'm going to show you how to set up the photo interpreter switch HY870P. So I was looking around the internet and it was really hard to find a video which described how to set this up. Okay, so the way I set mine up is I have a total of six volts. I have four AA batteries and I put a 300 ohm resistor and then after that I put it through what's on, which would be the left side of the switch. And then it just goes to ground, so it's a complete circuit. And on the right side, this is the side which will only work when there's no interruption. So for this side, I just have six volts and I got an LED to light up. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how it works. All right, so a small demo. I uh, got this coin here, and when I put it in the between, you can see that the light turns off. And then if I remove it, oh, light turns on again. So it's pretty quick. Just on, off, on, off. And yeah, so this is a coin, it's pretty thick. But if you take something like a business card and you put that in between, let's put that. You can see that the light doesn't fully turn off. It gets dim, but it doesn't fully turn off. And that's because on this side, the little light which shines through into here, on this side, this is really powerful. And that's because I have only 300 ohms of resistance, so there's a lot of current still going through the left side of the circuit. So if you want, if you have like a thinner material for whatever project you're doing, and you still want to turn completely off, what you're going to want to do is put more resistance. So instead of just 300 ohms over here, like you could put something like a thousand or 2000 ohms and then that should help. So when you put a thinner material through, it'll fully turn off. So keep in mind that as you add more resistance to the left side, even when there's nothing in between the light itself will be dimmer overall, but all right, that's been it. Thanks YouTube. Bye.